Oh, y'all have gone too far now! Ah! <laughs> what is up, everybody? My name is Tom, and this is episode seven of At the Dead of Night. Y'all have lost your mother minds make it that photo edit of me okay i was absolutely blown away when i saw that shit on twitter the other day and i have not recovered okay if y'all ever say i look like jimmy again you're getting rko'd to hell stop i love the people appreciate y'all watching appreciate y'all coming through and watching my videos every day i'm serious but honestly that tweet Got me bamboozled. Listen, today we're back. We're playing some more At the Dead of Night. Y'all absolutely love this series, so I'm going to keep pumping out the episodes as quickly as I can. But I do want to warn y'all right now that moving forward, I am going to be out of town for a little bit. So making the videos on this shit is going to slow down a little bit, okay? I'm sorry, but that's the way it's got to be. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas, you bitches. Okay, so anyway, just know holidays are going to slow down the shits a little bit. I'm going to try and pump them out as quickly as I can. But, uh, mm, uh, mm, uh 7,000 likes? Yeah, I think so. Drop the shit. And as soon as I can get the episode out, I will again. I don't know if it's going to be the day after or not. That's just a little bit more difficult given the holidays. Damn, I cannot believe that's what y'all got me for Christmas. Oh, I'm stunned! Oh, my God! Okay, let's run the shit. Let's see what Jimmy's up to in this episode. I'm going to pop off. I'm pissed. Let's motherfucking go. Woo! Okay, fuck. Okay. So I'm going to have to tell y'all what just happened right here. But first, I, is this door locked? It fucking is. Okay, but first I need to get to a safe zone because I am not going to describe to y'all what is happening right here. It's not going to happen. Okay, first things first, I'm getting the fuck in the elevator and getting the fuck out of here. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Ground floor! Okay, sorry, that really threw me right into this shit and I was not ready for that. Listen. Y'all saw that right when I started the episode, I was at the top of the third floor stairs, which, if y'all recall from the last episode, is one of the places I was supposed to be going. Now, I unintentionally saw the cutscene with Amy, like, crying at the top of the stairs off video. Okay, like, when I wasn't recording for a video. And so, y'all are just gonna have to miss that cutscene to take my word for it. That Amy was crying at the top of the stairs, okay? I didn't actually see the full cutscene because the second it started playing, I cut the shit off to try and, like, not save the gameplay progress. But I guess it saved the shit because obviously we were at the top of the stairs. So whatever the fuck happened to Amy at the top of the stairs, I'm sure I don't know what it was. But we're going to ask about it and inquire about it to a ghost, I'm sure. Now, the reason that I was playing this shit and not recording is because I was trying to get a thumbnail of Jimmy attacking me for the last YouTube video, okay? There was no good screenshots, so I had to get back into this shit to get a screenshot of Jimmy being a bitch in order to get a good thumbnail for the last video. So when I was doing that, I unintentionally fucking, like, progressed the story, and there's no way to stop the progression. So basically, long story short, I fucked up Merry Christmas. Okay, now, let me figure out what we're doing. Let me look at the mirror. Okay, go. Oh, by the way, as I'm running to look at the mirror, I do want to mention if y'all actually want to get me something, like, real for Christmas, just like my videos. Okay, like all of them. This one in particular, but all of my videos. And... Think about sharing them with your friends, okay? I could really use some extra views. Thank you! Da! Okay, y'all are amazing, though. Real talk, y'all have been killing with the sport. I can't ask for any more, but if I did, it would be that. I love y'all. Okay! Click the mirror. Let's see. What's going on? Fuck. Okay, hang on a minute. Y'all are probably blown away because now I'm in room 105 and you're like, what the fuck is happening? Legitimate question. Remember when I was talking about how I was trying to get the thumbnail on for this that last episode and I was like running around and shit? Okay, listen. I fucked up a couple of things in the process of doing that and so I had to fix all of the shits and now I fixed the shits and we are back to where we were at the end of the last episode. So now, let me look at the mirror and see what's happening for real now. Okay, because I didn't realize... That when I was trying to get the thumbnail, I lost the spirit box. And apparently on the last playthrough, at the end, it did not save me getting the fucking, uh, like, anesthetic that the doctor had. So I had to come back up here and get that. So now that I've got the anesthetic, which I think we're going to see here. Maybe? Yes? Okay, there it is. Now this is exactly where we left off. Got it. Okay, good. So I really was fucking up trying to get a thumbnail for this shit. I bamboozled this entire gameplay. Oh, and here is Harvey. Right. Okay, so wait a minute. Is it going to show me the scrapbook? It is. Okay, now I do want to give a quick shout out to a lot of high IQ gamers in the chat who said I was supposed to link the cutscene with Harvey talking about 
how Jimmy said that the doctor attacked him, but Harvey had heard the story before. I'm supposed to link that cutscene to the scrapbook. Okay, y'all some high IQ motherfuckers. I know I gotta do that, but to do that, I gotta get to the third floor. Now, somebody else also commented down below. Holy shit, I feel like I'm <laughs> giving y'all a lecture out this bitch talking this much. <laughs> y'all are welcome. Listen. Somebody else down below in the comment section also told me another high IQ strat on how you're supposed to trap Jimmy into the room, and I'm low-key thinking we might try it right here. Apparently, in order to properly lock Jimmy into the room, you're not supposed to hide in the wardrobe like I hid in the wardrobe. Y'all saw that when I hid in the wardrobe, I did that shit instantly before Jimmy even came in the room. Okay, y'all remember that shit? But apparently what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to come into the room, wait until you literally hear Jimmy open the door, and he can see you, and then you hide in the wardrobe. At that point, apparently Jimmy tri- At that point, apparently Jimmy tries to hide in the bathroom because he now technically knows you're in the wardrobe, and he wants to jump scare you trying to leave the room, and it's at that point that you can run past that bitch, say fuck you, and then make it outside and deadbolt the door. Okay, holy shit, I know I just talked a lot. Y'all are blown away. Merry Christmas. Dom, stop saying that shit! These motherfuckers don't want anything for Christmas. <laughs> Too bad, bitches. Wait a minute. I feel like Jimmy is close. Now here's what I want to do. I want to bait him to this room and try out the high IQ lock him in the room strat. Okay, that is really a top priority for me. I've been trying to do that shit for seven episodes, and honestly, it's a little disturbing that I still haven't done it. So I need to, that's just the top of my agenda. I'm not even going to lie. So first things first, I'm going to leave the room. Please don't suplex me, you motherfucking asshole. Okay, I'm not dead yet, which means this plan is hey. about to be bulletproof. All I'm going to do is yell for Jimmy like I've never yelled before. Let me verify. Okay, good. Now, I actually need to go back to the other room, 105. But in the meantime, I'm going to try and call Jimmy down here. I only want to see the keys. I cannot risk misclicking. Okay, it's the first one. Down here. So let me yell for Jimmy until he comes. And then I'll, I'll get back up with y'all. Because I, <laughs> I don't want y'all to have to watch me this fucking way. sitting here yelling for 25 minutes. Okay, because it is probably going to take a second. Kumbaya, my lord, Jimmy doesn't fuck with me. Kumbaya, my lord, Jimmy wants to toss my salad. Kumbaya, my lord, since I'm seeing y'all are still watching this, y'all are pissed. Okay, I'll stop! All right, let me get this bitch, wait. As I'm sitting here yelling for Jimmy, I'm honestly thinking that waiting for Jimmy to enter the room before I go into the wardrobe seems like a recipe to get FBI kicked in my head. But I don't know. It's I'm here. It's the only thing that sounds legitimate, and it, and it's really the only thing we haven't tried. So if that's not how you lock Jimmy in the room, I'm sure I don't know how you do that fucking shit. He's close now. There he is. Okay? Jimmy's here! Gotta go! Don't fuck up now, Dom! Okay, this plan seems stupid as fuck, but also semi-bulletproof. Now, wait, listen. Now. Okay, he definitely saw me high! Okay, I'm fucked. Okay, he's definitely in the bathroom. Go. Go! Go, you fuck! Go! Go, go, go! Go! You're fucked, asshole! Oh, he's mad. Uh-oh. That bitch sounds like he got a lockpick set! Wait a minute! It sounds like Jimmy's got a lockpick set! Let me not dilly-dally around and find out if he does or not! I'm out of this, motherfucker! I gotta go to the third floor! Oh my god! Shout out to the high IQ gamers in the comment section! Y'all are fucking brainiacs! Y'all have got to be related to Einstein! I am serious! So you really gotta wait for him to come in! And then he hides in the bathroom and tries to choke slam you. That actual motherfucker, dude. Okay, so Jimmy's fucked. For a minute, anyway. How long does he stay trapped? Honestly, probably not that long. This game's kind of fucked. No, bitch, that's not where I'm trying to go. So I need to get back down to Harvey's room, which, if I know the map, should be right- Fuck! Should be right here. 
It is. Okay, so let me get in here, let me talk to Harvey, let me ask him about the motherfucking scrapbook and that story, boo-boo ass story that Jimmy told him. Please, Harvey, please. There? My fucking boy! What's your name? Big Harvey! Okay, it is him. Now, what I do want to mention is that in the comment section, y'all also mentioned to me that whenever you're talking to the spirits, their main, like, thing they want to talk about is whatever happened in the cutscene. So you're basically always doing this one first. Okay, wait a second. Oh, it didn't save any of my shits. Okay, I gotta click through all these motherfuckers again because apparently I've never talked to Harvey because this game didn't save my shit. But that's okay, it's not a big deal. I'm gonna ask about this. And then from there, we'll, we'll, we'll make the connection. Okay, so wait a sec. Let me do all this. Let me ask this one so y'all can see. Where did the bottle of diazepam come from? Diazepam. Probably the doctor left it. Okay, so that really wasn't riveting. Okay, we probably could have got away without showing you all that. But let me show you the Amy at the top of the stairs question too, because we've never seen this one. I saw the little girl at the top of the stairs, on the banister. What was she doing? She dropped a bottle of whiskey. She didn't know what she was doing. Oh, so that was a video of Amy looking litty titty! Oh, shit! So we missed that part. Sorry, y'all. I fucked up. I saw a man saying okay. Jimmy had lied about the assault. Who was he? Yeah, so y'all have seen all this. We'll cut it. I'll be back with y'all in a sec. Oh, for the love of God! Okay, I just had to click through every single one of these shits again, and it has me bamboozled with how long it took to learn all that information. Hello, 25 minutes later. Now, okay, listen. I've learned my lesson. The game doesn't save always when I think it does. Lesson number one. Lesson number two, dumb. Stop trying to get thumbnails when you're not playing the game for real, bitch. Got it! Okay, I got it. So, yes, this episode has been a little bit of a shit show so far, but now we are actually caught back up to where we were last time. Okay, let me link Jimmy or fucking Harvey telling Rose about Jimmy, and let me link the scrapbook because this will be some of the first new shit we've seen all day. Go. When you said you'd heard the story somewhere before, does that have something to do with what you said about the scrapbook? It came straight out of it. As soon as I found that scrapbook, I knew where Jimmy had got it from. It was the same, down to every detail. Wow, so Jimmy's plagiarism game, whack as fuck! Okay, so let's see. Now I'm gonna be able to do some new shit. Amy was litty titty at the stop of the stairs on floor three. Okay, Harvey told me to fuck off now. I've got that. Is anyone there? Correct. Yes, that is correct. I'm not sure if Jimmy is still trapped in room 105. With my luck, he's probably not. I don't know how you know when he's not trapped. Okay, I guess you just get hit on the head and that's how you find out, asshole. Let's see, let's look at the mirror. We're supposed to be doing something on floor three, but I don't know with who or for what reason. Okay, here's the dock. We gotta do something with the syringe. Okay, I gotta ask somebody about the syringe, but I'm not sure who. Okay, motherfucker, I got that, but where? I might just have to start searching. I might just have to start searching. Oh, another thing. Oh, that's on the first floor, actually. Another thing that y'all told me about. In the comment section. I'm trying to see if there's anything different with Harvey real quick. Is that apparently. Oh, yeah, look. Oh, that's not useful at all, motherfucker. What does the number say? It looks like it's a. I think I know where that is. I think that's at the far end of the other hallway. I've seen that area before. I'm pretty sure I know where that is. Okay, so anyway, real quick. Y'all were telling me down below in the comments section that you know those fucking rooms that I keep coming across from time to time that... that have, like, no room number and they're just, like, the black door? Apparently, those are store rooms on the different floors. And that I can use the, the like, trillion storeroom keys that I have to open them. Supposedly. Okay, not really sure why those rooms aren't marked, and it's not obvious, but that would explain why I had so many storeroom keys. Wait a minute. Wait a fucking second! I just heard Jimmy running, bitch! I just heard Jimmy running. I literally heard him. I heard the pitter-patter of his fucking little feet. Like a freight train out of hell ready to rail me. That motherfucker! So he's out! Maybe that's the he escaped noise. It's possible that's what that was. I'm a little worried now. Wait a second. So Jimmy 
is running around this hotel with a lockpick kit. <laughs> you love to see it. I was hoping he was going to jump out the window and fucking die. But that's not what happened. This bitch escaped. And he's probably twice as mad. You love to see it. Okay, wait a second. I don't really want to leave this room. But I kind of got to leave this room. I'm going to get fucking tossed. I don't want to yell for him. This is a one way. I'm just going to have to roll the dice on this bitch, y'all. And hope to God that Jimmy isn't too pissed. That I flex the shit out of his ass. Go. Watch out. Go. Jimmy, no, please. Jimmy! Uh-oh. 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 Ah! No, no, no. No, 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 no! He's camping the stairs again! Oh, like, I wouldn't get fucked right there! No, bitch, no! Okay, he's back. He's back for sure! That bald cap wearing asshole! So he's camping again. He's out to get my ass. Where the fuck is Doc? Where's this noise coming from? Is it in here? Where am I hearing that at? Where the fuck? Uh oh. Y'all ready to get tossed? Is it in here again? I think it's in here. Is he still in the bathroom? Oh, the doc just camping out in this bitch. Oh, the doc ain't never gonna Is leave the Dr. bathroom. Yes, I'm Dr. Bose. Okay, let me ask him about the medicine. Where did the bottle of diazepam come from? It will help treat impulsive behavior in some people. <laughs> Okay. So did Jimmy feed you the glass sandwich because you tried to give him I that or what? Girl at the top of the stairs on the banister. What was she doing? Jimmy made the girl drink too much. Uh, no more deets. You man saying Jimmy you had fuck. lied about the assault. Who was he? It was Harvey. He knew Jimmy was lying about me. Harvey understood. Okay, so that's good, but did did he get the glass sandwich because of the, di the diazepam? Let's find out. When you said you needed to step up Jimmy's treatment urgently. That's it. Does that have something to do with what you said about the diazepam? Guaranteed! It wasn't the ideal medication, but it was all I had. Jimmy needed treating immediately. He was dangerous. Oh my god. Okay, so y'all were right about that shit. The, the thing those motherfuckers want to talk about is always whatever you see in the cutscene. Okay, and I'm going to the second floor, which is good, because I'm going to hit the stairs and fuck off! I'm, I'm getting the fuck out of here right now. Please, God, don't tell Jimmy's... Down here. Go! The stairs are safe, motherfuckers! Oh, the stairs are safe, and I love to hear that shit. Oh, that's a Christmas present from the good Lord above. It has to be. Okay, hit this. Hit that. Actually, let me go look at the fucking, let me go look at the mirror real quick, okay? I just want to see exactly where I'm going on each floor, if it'll show me. And let me see if there's any new deets to be revealed. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. So I know where I need to go on the third floor, I'm pretty sure, if I'm not a ninkit boob, which I very well could be! And if you already said dumb, we know you are for sure. I'm above it, though. I didn't say it. I showed you. There's a difference. Showing you is not toxic. Guaranteed. Not toxic 2020. Oh, shit. Okay, so the docks on the second floor, we knew that shit. No location. Is it just going to show me Harvey on the third floor? I think it might. I think what I'm figuring out, if it just shows me a three, I'm right. Okay, it does just show me a three. Yeah, so if you look at the mirror and you're not on the floor that it lists, it just tells you generally what floor to be on. But if you're on the floor, it'll give you a specific location. Okay, I'm figuring this shit out. And just for the record, what percent am I at? 33! Oh, shit! Oh, and y'all been praying on my downfall. I'm fucking unraveling this mystery like goddamn Sherlock Holmes in this bitch. Okay. 
Let's hit a lick. Fuck, not like that. Come on, bitch. There we go. All right, let's get in. We're going straight to floor. Let's go to floor three, okay? Because I know where it's at. I think I know where it's at. And Jimmy should really either be on the first or the second floor, because statistically, since there's three choices, there's only a 33% chance he's on this floor with me, so I should have a second to fucking book it. Unless I get flex coming out of the elevator. That has happened before. Be quiet, Tom, and pay attention. Listen closely. Oh my god, bitch, he's already here. I heard his footsteps. The pitter-patter of an actual asshole! Okay, this is the room, I'm pretty sure. But I need to hit the spyglass, dude. I heard Jimmy's big ogre ass running around behind me trying to flex me, dude. I heard him. This is definitely the room. Okay, because this chair off to the right, right down here, is I'm 90% sure the one I saw in the flashback, which makes it either this room or that room. And I'm pretty sure it's this one. Which also means that when I turn around, there's probably a fucking cutscene to be played. Wash out. Clear. 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 Okay, let's search. There must be something I need to find here. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, it's gotta be a cutscene then. Watch out. Wait. Am I not in the right place? Bro, this is definitely it. Did I just get set up? This is a dead end! I think I just got set up! It's got. Let me. Let me. Let me look. Let me look. Let me look. So now let's pay attention. That's Harvey. This is the third floor. Yeah, it's definitely this room. That is one thousand percent this fucking room. But you know what I think? We might have missed a cutscene because I was fucking booking it for my life. I think we might not have got a cutscene that we were supposed to. That's what I think. Because if I take out this fucking thingy right now and I have a high energy state, I know that we missed a mandatory cutscene. Okay, so I hear Jimmy. He's kind of close. Is someone there? Yeah, okay, so that is it. I missed a cutscene. I was moving too quick for this shit. I'm gonna get tossed. So I really have to leave this room and go back up the hallway so I can see the cutscene? But I'm gonna get literally so blacked. And I don't want to yell for Jimmy, because that's how you get pounded. Like, I do not want Jimmy coming down here, because this is where I got to be. So am I about to go to Toss City, dude? Pretty sure. Let me listen, dude. I need to hear this motherfucker far away. He was literally on my ass the second I got out of the elevator. Oh, it sounded like he was a long ways away, actually. This might be my chance. Oh my god, please! Tell me I didn't misread that vocal tone. Now turn and see the cutscene. It's gotta be right here. Good. Show me the cutscene. Show me! Okay, fuck you. Oh, it's in this room. Oh, it's in this room, maybe. I mean, okay, Jimmy's a long ways off. It's gotta be in this room then. Watch out for the cutscene. Watch out, bitches. Oh. A ring in a box? Okay, at least we found something. A coil of copper wire. Why are they showing me the room across the hall if that's not the one I'm supposed to be in? Watch out. Now! Now! Clear! Okay, Jimmy's a long ways off. I love to hear it. I think I still gotta talk to Harvey right here. Uh, let me see what's happening. I wish I could skip, like, certain parts of this. Because if I see the dock is on the second floor one more time! Not mad. Not mad. Not mad. Okay, what's new? Is it still going to show me this room? Because that means I got to talk to Harvey down here. Okay, I do. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. I've now found the wedding ring. So let me talk to my boy Harvey and see what's up. Let me see what's up with my boy. Okay, this is good. This is not bad. I wish there was a cutscene because that would have made talking to him a little easier. This is still a high. This is still a high energy state. 
How? Am I still missing a cutscene? I must be. This is, I mean. Jimmy? I know you can hear me. I know you made it up, your little story about that psychiatrist. I know where you got it from. I knew I'd read it before. It's in your bloody scrapbook. And this was footage of Harvey's last day alive! I guarantee Jimmy suplexed his ass! I guarantee it! Okay, that's good. I wanted a cutscene. Now I can learn something. That was kind of slick. Oh, is he in the hallway? Is it, Harvey? Yeah, okay, so this is the voice vaguely heard bullshit, which means either I gotta go into the room or I gotta go into the hallway. Let me is see which. Hallway? Yeah, okay. All right, all right, all right, I got it. Fuck you, bitch. Okay, so buddy in the spectral plane, but apparently it's easier to move in real life than it is in the fucking spirit realm. Shit got me. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? So Jimmy's mother fu fucking ass knows that I need to talk to Harvey in the hallway. So guess who's out in the hallway waiting to chat to? Motherfucking Jimmy. That bitch thinking we... Oh my god, motherfucking ass. He trying to come out here and have an intervention with Harvey too. No, fuck you. So I gotta wait. I gotta wait. Oh, Dude, he sounds really close. How the fuck does he know I'm down here? I haven't made a motherfucking noise, dude. I haven't yelled for that bitch. I've been on my tiptoes, and now, Jimmy trying to take me to Pound Town. This fucking asshole! Apparently, he doesn't believe in the spirit of Christmas and leaving me the fuck alone. <gasps> Damn, fuck. Okay, let me just wait. Let me just wait. Let me just see. If I can hear him yell a long ways off. Because I need to go right outside this door. And y'all saw who's waiting for me. Oh, shit. It's just a waiting game now. Just a waiting game. Let me see what's happening on Twitter. By the way, if y'all aren't following me on Twitter, you should do that. At I am Don Plays. Appreciate that. Dude, this guy is no joke. This guy is no fucking joke. He's still here! It's been five! Count it! Five minutes, and that asshole is still outside this room. I've been sitting here waiting just to hear him yell something from like across the hotel so I can be like, hey, let me go talk to my boy Harvey. But instead, Jimmy hasn't fucking moved. I think you might have to take a hit to the head here. I'm not even gonna lie. I think you might have to take a hit to the head here. Cause this motherfucker's camping, dude. He's outside waiting for me. Is that a long ways up? That does not sound far off. Let me listen, dude. He's got to fuck off sometime soon. I'm gonna give it another couple minutes, and if he's still here, I think he might have to die. I don't. I think there might not be another option. Also worth noting, I do not have a deadbolt for this room or the one across, so that's not an option. Just waiting for Jimmy to go to hell. Hey, hey, just waiting for Jimmy to get a hobby. This song is trash. Okay, yeah, I'm done. Bye. Fuck. Dude, I don't think he fucks off, dude. He's right here. He's right here. I don't have a deadbolt. I'm gonna get tossed if I yell for him. I'm literally gonna get tossed. Yeah, you have to get railed. I'm pretty sure you have to get railed. I'm 90%. 90%. Maybe there's like a cutscene that has to do with it. I'm sure I don't know. Should I try yelling for should I try yelling for this asshole? Pretty sure that just arrests me to get FBI. I don't know what the move is here, y'all. I really don't. Now, if I go out, stand in the hallway, talk to the homeboy Harvey, but I don't go up the hallway, will Jimmy still toss me? I don't think so. I think that might be a recipe not to get railed, and then maybe I can come back in the room and hide. Maybe. I don't know. I really don't. <laughs> oh my god, bitch. I'm gonna go out in the hallway. I don't think I'll die. Just going out in the hallway. I think I'll die if I try and leave the hallway. Let me just verify one more time. Hello. That Harvey is vague as fuck. 
Ooh, Harvey. Do you want to come into room 108? Ooh. Oh, fuck me. Okay, asshole. Dude, can I hear Jimmy 100 miles away, please? He did not respond to my ghost talk. He don't fuck with me. Harvey's in cahoots with Jimmy, dude. He's trying to get me killed. He's trying to get me out in the hallway. I'm going to have to do it. I'm going to have to do it. Give it a 10 count. 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. 5. 4. 3. 2. <laughs> Time to get tossed! No, fucker. I'm dead. I'm actually dead! Hi! Me and Harvey been waiting for you! No way! Harvey! Yeah. Save me! Is someone there? Oh, 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 oh! Not where I'm supposed to be! Not where I'm supposed to be! Uh oh. Hi, and welcome to Toss Nation. I'm your host, Don Plays. I think you have to die, dude. If I talk to Harvey in here and he doesn't say anything. No! That was so fucking stupid. I'm here. Oh, that was such a big fuck up. Uh oh. I gotta hide in the wardrobe. If Jimmy comes through, I gotta hide in the wardrobe. Pretty sure I see his ass scheming right here. That motherfucker, dude. Okay, I don't think he's coming in, though. I don't have a deadbolt. I'm not trying to get tossed. Let me see about Harvey. I misclicked that shit again. Is anyone there? I think you have to get tossed. Don't fuck you, Harvey! Fuck you royally! I think you have to die. Jimmy's camping. I'm at a dead end, and I'm railed. Pretty sure he's right here. I think that's him. Watch, it'll move in a sec. Just give it a sec. Watch, it'll move. It'll move. It'll move. Why the fuck wouldn't it move? Come on, Jimmy. Just do your shit, bitch. I'm... Wait, he sounds like he's a long ways off, actually. Okay, it sounds like he fucked off. I gotta go. I gotta go. No, I should look at the mirror. No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Let me look at the mirror. Let me look at the mirror. Let me look at the mirror. I'm fucking up. I have not looked at the mirror. Let me look. Let me look, let me look, let me look. Okay, love that, love that. Dude, I'm pretty sure Jimmy's camping. But the last time I heard that bitch, he did sound a long ways off. So maybe he actually got a hobby. Let me see what's up with Harvey. In no way I'm still supposed to be down here. Because where the fuck is he? Like, I cannot talk to this asshole. What in the flying fuck is that? I think that's the heater. I think that's the heater. Because remember he said the heater was giving electric shocks. And I saw some little lightning bolts just go. Is Harvey around here? If he's not in the room, he's literally nowhere down here. Is anyone there? No. Dude, he's not in the hallway? Spirit is distant. Move closer. I have the compass. I forgot about the compass. Let me see where this thing's telling me to go. All right, let me wait and hear Jimmy real quick. Let me hear this bitch far away one more time. I might just have to get tossed here, y'all. I might just have to get tossed. I've been in this room for like 30 minutes. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna chance this shit. Is it stupid? Yes, don't talk to me about stupid. I'm fucked! Hello? Is anyone there? Hello? Is it Harvey? Yes. Oh, I got this bitch! Why is he down here? Motherfucker, I don't know. I saw you shouting. I don't know. Jimmy to admit he lied. Did he? They wanted you to die, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure that's what that was. Of course he didn't. He just laughed. Then he started setting little traps for me. Some of them not so little. Okay, definitely the heater. 100% the heater, but let's click the other shits first. What was the coil of wire used for? Jimmy used to carry it around with him. No idea why. Huh, <laughs> yeah you know why. For a fucking tripwire to kill your ass. 
Wait. Who did the wedding? I just heard Jimmy to? giggling. Somebody told me you can't die in this. Somebody told me you can't die in this. Was that a lie, bitch? I don't. No, I think I might be about to get tossed. Let me ask quick. Let me ask quick. I got limited time. For you, does that have anything to do with what you said about the dangerous? I've got limited time left on this planet, bitches. Jimmy's giggling. I'm dead. Always playing with electricity. After this goes down, I'm fucking dead. First floor. First floor. I'm tossed though. Who gives a fuck about the first floor? I'm actually dead right now. Dude. No! No! Look at the red shit! I clicked the wrong fucking thing! Go! Where is he? He's He's here! He's here! I got a wrench into the bottom! So Jimmy saw me when I was on the fucking thingamajig! Jimmy saw me when I was on the thingamajig. I got a wrench into the bottom when I was on the fucking box. Are you fucking kidding me? Where was he? The fact that I didn't get tossed has me blown away. I don't know where he was. I couldn't see him. Obviously, I was on the fucking box. But he's also not here, question mark? Is he not going to come through? Jim, 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 A. I got to reset this shit. Can you come through real quick? And don't toss me. Come through, but don't rail me, please. Dude, Jimmy is camping. I think the entire purpose of this part of the map is to get you fucked. Like they said, hey, Dom, come down this fucking one-way hallway so that we can let Jimmy know and he can fucking rail you. Pretty sure that's what they were thinking. Look it. I still got the red shits. He's not even making noise, dude. He's not even making noise. He knows he's got me. He knows he's got me. I'm dead. You might have to die to get a new cutscene. I don't know. I don't know. Pretty sure I just got to go and get tossed. Because he's not coming down here. He's not coming in. There's no strat that's going to work except dying. Okay, time to go to hell, bitches. Bam. Bam. Oh, so now it did the shit. I already knew Jimmy was there. Why are we acting like I didn't know Jimmy was there? I knew he was there. There we go. Okay. Not hiding in the bathroom. Fuck that plan. In the wardrobe now before he gets in. Okay. He was not in yet. I don't have a key to deadbolt him, so that's not the move. Wait. No. He's in the bathroom. He's in the bathroom. This is a ruse. Wait. Don't let him bamboozle you. I'm pretty sure he's in the bathroom. That noise, when he came in and like instantly left, was the same noise that he made when he hid in the bathroom. Which means I'm going to get railed if I leave this room. So all I gotta do is have more patience than Jimmy. Except, so far, seems like Buddy's pretty patient. Dude, no fucking way. There's nothing to be done. There's nothing to do. Y'all wanna sing some Christmas hymns or something? Like, what the fuck are we supposed to do? This shit's some bullshit. Bro, that sounds like he's right outside this fucking wardrobe. Unless I hear Jimmy a long ways off. That doesn't sound that far away. Oh my god, bitch. I'm just trying to get off this third floor and out of this area of the hallway. I might just run for it. If I take a hit to the head, I've already got a save point after I talk to Harvey, I'm pretty sure. So that means that it'll spawn me on a different floor and it'll be way safer than it is here. So I might just have to die. Fuck it! Jimmy! Fuck you! Go, don't fuck around, just go, bitch. If I'm dying, I'm gonna die as a man! Tossed! 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 How? No way! Don't! 
Get your hopes up. Suplex City. Suplex City! Wait! How? I don't know. I don't know. We were worried for no reason. Guess Jimmy is a low IQ gamer. Fucking asshole. I heard it over here. Where am I hearing it at? Pretty sure it was up that other way. But the arrow's pointing this way. Uh oh. Pretty sure I just heard Jimmy, dude. Where? Here. Oh, shit! Oh, I thought he was dead. That bitch got hit by an electric chair, but lived. Harvey looks kinda mad. This room looks kinda dark. Fuck! Watch out, cause I'm pretty sure I heard Jimmy following me. I don't know how. Jimmy was definitely on the third floor. No idea how the fuck he'd be down here. But this is another dead end hallway. Of course it is, dude. Harvey always got me at the end of dead fucking ends, dude. Shit's bullshit. <laughs> Harvey, is please. Is it Harvey? It has to be. Yeah, it's Harvey. Okay, so I saw your motherfucking ass getting electrocuted nasty. I saw you suffering an electric shock. What happened? Wait, what, what happened? He knew that was my heater. He had arrived the casing straight to the mains. Almost killed me. He did it deliberately. But Rose wouldn't have it. I knew he needed to be taught a lesson. He damaged my property, so I decided to damage his. Oh, uh, wait, wait, wait a minute, Harvey. You're going tit for tat with a psychopath? What could go wrong? Uh, so Harvey apparently damaged something of Jimmy's. But I'm pretty sure that we don't have whatever that is. Okay, actually, let me read exactly what he said. He said, I knew that it was my heater. He wired the casing to the mains, and I knew he needed to be taught a lesson. So the only connection that I can potentially make right now is this and this. So if this isn't it, then I gotta find something else. Okay, because Harvey said he fucked up something with Jimmy's, but I don't know what it was, because I don't have that item. When you said you decided to damage his property, is that connected to what you said about the coil of wire? No way. That makes no sense. That's not it. Yeah, okay. So that's definitely not it. Fucking knew that shit. I don't have the item I need for that. Okay, that's a guarantee. I gotta find something of Jimmy's that's busted up. Because right now I don't have it. I'm supposed to go to the dock. On what floor is this motherfucker on? Second floor. Fuck a moly crackatoli, bitch. So where's Harvey? I guess Amy's story is just done. Okay, litty titty little Amy. She ain't come back after she had those whiskey sips. She done. 216. I think that's where I'm at now, is it? Oh no, 216's on the second floor. I'm on the first floor. That's where the item I need for Harvey is. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, hold on a minute, y'all. Stop. Wait a minute. Stop. 37% complete. Y'all know I'm the best gamer that ever lived. But I have been recording this episode for over an hour now. So I am going to call this episode episode 7. I'm not going to try and do the fingers, okay? That's too high IQ for me. But this is episode 7 of At the Dead of Night. If y'all are still enjoying this series, like I said, make sure y'all let me know that down below with some love. Subscribe if you're new. And I will drop another episode of this shit as quickly as I can, okay? I promise I will, but again, it's the holidays, so it might be a little slower than they've been in the past, okay? I love y'all. Thank you guys so much for the support. Again, if y'all want to give me a Christmas present, like the video, share my shits. I really do appreciate that. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. See y'all soon. Follow me on Twitter if y'all want updates on what's going on with the holidays, okay? Big thanks. Gotta go. Bye-bye. Peace.